Hello everyone, have a good day. Greetings from the Netherlands. It's a beautiful day again. It's almost evening here in Holland. It's 6 30, but uh, we have sun until 10 o'clock at least. Today we are gonna be riding a little bit in countryside of Holland. Uh, we are about 15 kilometers away from Amsterdam city centrum. This is WASP and WASP has three historical original size windmill. This is one of them. Uh, this is windmill Friendskap. It means friendship. As I remember it's from 17th century or 18th century and it's still working on saturday they sell, they sell the goods produced uh, through this windmill and another one is over there i don't know its name you can check it later the temperature is around 18 celsius and this is my bike today i will be riding on this bike you know, usually I'm uh, riding on my foldable bike. Uh, it's very compact and easy to use and I can take it to the train or metro without paying extra money. But today I decided to ride with this one. This is a German brand BSF Farhat Manufacture. Uh, it's a touring bike. It's designed for long distance tours actually today we do not have that kind of long distance tour but we will be riding approximately uh, two hours almost maybe one and a half hour we will see that let me arrange the large light screen and then we will start to our tour hello Elise Anaria Daniel Pablo T, good afternoon, Merve Saraj, Fatih Saraj, family is here again with us, Billy McMath, hello, Chris, you're welcome, my pleasure. Now we are starting nearby the river, it's a beautiful view here and there are sitting areas in hot weather, uh, people also get into the river from here. Now let's go. <laughs> By the way, this is the town I live. So I live in Wasp. And uh, because of that, today is more comfortable to me. I just got out from the home and uh, in minutes I have started to the live stream bicycle tour. Hello, I like turtles. I hope we will have a good connection today because we will not be in the city center and we will be riding between uh, the three towns hopefully we will have a good connection and we will complete our tour in at least one and a half hour the red one uh, <laughs> the red one is at home he's resting This town, Wasp, actually is a city. It's from 14th century. And currently it's part of Amsterdam province, municipality.
three or four years ago uh, there was an election and uh, people choose people had to choose one of two province two municipality to connect and most of the people who live in Wesp they choose Amsterdam the other one was Hoi and Meiren region and actually today we will be riding towards the Hoi and Meiri mayor I cannot pronounce it correctly region enjoy the ride I will not be speaking too much today, instead I will leave you with the beautiful view around us. First stop will be Madun. Madun is a town nearby. It's from 13th century, 12th century. It's older than Wasp. And the last stop will be Narden. Narden was an important city in the Middle Age. Along with Utrecht. And the Narden has a beautiful shape from the sky or from Google Maps. You can check it. Narden. It has a star shape. There are some other cities or towns with star shape in the Netherlands, but I think the best shape is belong to Narden. Also Narden is a well fortified city. show you the view here because it's a, it has a very beautiful view here in Wesp and the other side another time we will be walking in Wesp so I will show you the city in more detail Wasp is only 17 minutes from Amsterdam Centrum by train and by bicycle it takes 45 minutes maximum and also there is a bus station in front of the train station uh, it goes to Amsterdam Zadost Bermer Arena and every 15 minutes there is a train uh, to Amsterdam or Schiphol or Utrecht side Oops, wrong way. <laughs> I'm sleeping. We have to follow this side.
another beautiful view here Most of the residential building houses in Wesp are from 17th century, by the way. There are more than 1000 national monuments in the city. Oops. We are gonna cross a beautiful bridge seconds later. Yes, drone will be nice. <laughs> Maybe I will do that later. Not on a live stream, but uh, for a pre-recorded videos, I will show you some drone views. Small half an inch. Pot park, <laughs> and we will go this way and follow the canal side, river side to the modern. Hello, Carmela from Italy. <laughs> Ciao, Monica. As you see, this is a shared road with cars, bikes, scooters. There is no separate bike lane here. 
uh, there is another way in the parallel. Uh, there, there is a, a bike lane. However, the scene is more beautiful on this road, so I choose this one. And also, there are not many cars in this road, to be honest. I mean, comparing to Amsterdam traffic or other countries. Yeah, the connection was weak because of the tunnel, I think. I hope it's better now. So first time we are doing a live stream tour between towns, not in a crowded city. So there is a possibility that connection would go off later. We will see together. This is the place I buy my plants and flowers. It's a huge indoor area. And there are everything related to flowers and plants. Hello Darren, welcome. Fatih, are you kidding Hello Colin, welcome to the live stream right. It is I think it's a wise choice. And also we can hear bird sounds. Sounds of the nature. By the way, I forgot to mention that our left side is full with both houses, with garden. I mean, the other side is uh, the canal. Canal or river, I'm not sure. I think it should be river, river fecht. Fecht means fight.
at the end of this road we will see Maden small beautiful town and there is an important castle in that town also it's the beginning of Fecht River Fight River like this left side is full with both houses decrypted Fatih Sarai's secret sentence <laughs> thanks to Google Translate yes mother's slot slot means castle in English mother's slot is mother castle it's a beautiful well preserved uh, castle from 13th century or 12th century I'm not sure and it's possible to go inside in daytime or weekend with a museum ticket because it's a museum and you can visit most of the rooms including the dungeon of the castle and you can have experience about the 17th century Dutch life Hello. The farm on my right, there was a sign. They sell farm products such as milk, cheese, egg. So in this area, uh, you can access to organic products easily. You don't need to go to the supermarket for most of the things. You can just visit the farms and get your organic products actually this this right right bicycle ride is a bit experimental because first time we are riding in countryside between towns and villages normally you know we always do our walking tours in the city centrums or bike tours so if you like this type of bicycle ride we will do more in the future because there are many beautiful areas similar to this in more nature more away from the city crowd so leave your comments about it uh, later if you wish which one would you prefer both or one of them would you prefer the centrums or more natural side more countryside etc i will read your comments later tomorrow because i cannot follow all the conversations now i can see only some of them
İyi akşamlar Ayla Duman. Hoş geldiniz. Hey Darren, yes, uh, I have a few videos on my channel and uh, one and a half month ago or two months ago we were in Heathorn for live walking tour and before that I had shared a pre-recorded Heathorn video in 4K and 3D sound quality and also I had passed through torn by my bicycle with friends so there are some bicycle tour videos cover heat on too you can check it later if you wish the weather is perfect Colleen I think Colleen wrote yes it's true the only disadvantage of the good weather is there are so many flies and they attack to my eyes <laughs> and again I, I forgot my sunglasses so I ride carefully I don't go faster yes Darren you are right it's a bit far away but especially the last one when we did our live walking tour the weather was perfect and there were not so many people we walk around very comfortable in such a good weather under sun that was nice We are getting closer to Madr, Madden, sorry, Madden. <laughs> the pronunciation is not easy at the beginning. Madden. Hello, Paula Mello. Welcome to the right. Hello, Mohammed. Hello Harjot, good to see you again, thanks. Wow, we are in Madden almost and I saw a pirate flag, let me try to show you. There's a black flag over there. Can you see that also a European community flag Holland also.
Yes, we see the modern, we see modern sign. Welcome sign, thank you, welcome for the welcome. You're so nice, modern. Another beautiful town. Thanks, Elise. I survived so far. It smells nice here. Not about joints, but flowers. Soon I'm gonna show you some beautiful views. Let me check the message. The green. Yes, Paolo, these roads take us to the castle. It's true. <laughs> and, uh, and Mohammed, for your question, we start from Wisp. But uh, only 20 minutes ago we started actually. Hello, Olegas. Let's continue. Before continue, I'm gonna show you the river view. So this is Fecht River. which means fight in English and th this river was an important defense, defense line in the past until the second world war Dutch people were using this river site as a water line defense It's, it was an outer side of Amsterdam defense. So they, they will open the bridge because probably there are some boats on the waiting list. I'm gonna show you, hopefully. Oh, it's not. Wrong alarm. We will be following the opposite way. I'm just showing the streets to you.
It's beautiful. Don't worry, Mohamed, we will be doing a walking tour another time. We just passed through today. Another time I will show you the ways uh, in details. It's picturesque. And I saw a nice houseboat. Let's see that one also. Here it is. And there's a nice terrace site. go back to our route Madden is very nice cute town city but uh, the real estate opportunities are very limited here also there is not a train station there's only bus In Narden also, there is not a bus uh, train station. There is a shared train station, Busum Narden train station, but it's in Busum. So both Marden and uh, Narden are beautiful towns and cities. However, transportation it is not easier as much as the Wasp. In Wasp. The metro station of Amsterdam is also only 10 minutes by bike. I'm here to show you some nice boat houses. Just at the other side of the river or canal, I don't know. Very quite peaceful and looks beautiful in a beautiful weather like this. Let's go back. That house is amazing. Farage family don't miss this one. It's just in the center of the park. And it has an old style architecture, also modern.
So if I just try to suicide in my eyes. It's pity. He chose my eyes to die. Next time I shouldn't forget my sunglasses for sure. It's raining flies. Interesting red light is on for the bridge. Let's push the button. This is one of the towns I passed through on my bicycle tour in Holland six or seven years ago, six years ago, I think. Oops, I forgot to show you mother's lot. We cannot get inside, but at least I can show you from distance. Uh, Yeah, maybe too much rounding. I'm gonna show you from the left side, okay. I'll not go back. Oh, there's also construction on the right side. There's a beautiful terrain here. It's a bit hill, so you can have a nice view from there. But I think they're renovating there also, like many other places in the Netherlands. Yeah, unfortunately the whole area under renovation so I had decided to plan to show you the view from there but I think it will not be possible let's see the end If you can't see anything, then we will return to the northern route.
yeah it's pretty I can't show you the castle this is the entrance but also I mean entrance to the garden side but it's also even not possible now and from this way I, I could show you the distance view but it's under construction so let's say the next time I'm moving forward to Narden Sundari, this is Maden. Now we are heading to Narden. We already passed Wisp. We started in Wisp actually. Narden is, according to the sign, seven kilometers away from here. Right, again we are in bird zones, birdies. Goodbye, Madden, Todd Sins, Todd Falkenekeer. Empty areas. Some farmlands.
sometimes this scene will, will be boring if we write more than two hours in the same scene so there are some places like that but I haven't rode my bike in these routes uh, since last year maybe more so I'm not bored that's nice and it's a perfect weather It looks like a bicycle highway, right? <laughs> but it's not. On my right, there's a car lane for vehicles. Yeah, we can call it bicycle highway a bit. But there are many, uh, many type of bike lanes similar to these all over the Netherlands and I have seen bigger ones wider ones and in our bicycle tour last weekend we passed through a bicycle bridge only bicycle and pedestrians are allowed on that bridge I always confuse on this corner which way, left or right right is okay but let's also see the left maybe there is another way I know the right side is okay but there will be another way yeah I think this one goes to Narden too Nardenstraatweg Let's try our chance I remember like this way goes to Narden also Let's see If not we will go back The town we just passed is Maderberg and it was on the left side also a little bit further from here
Yes, I saw a boat with name Narden. We are on the correct way. Please hit the like button if you are enjoying the tour so far and also I put some links on the description of this video like our community page discord server you can join to our discord server ask your questions share your memories pictures and chat with other members and my social media accounts also on the description yes this way goes to Narden the left side goes to Almere port and Almere side there is a nice small beach in Almere port in hot weather sometimes I just go there by following this route Almere port is it takes like how far from Wisp with a fast speed, fast pace it's a modern small city it was uh, built after 2002 it's very new everything is new there even Rotterdam is older than Almere port <laughs> as an architecture So the left side is like this empty lands with some animals, calls, sheep, but they are in distance.
I'm happy that we didn't follow the right side way because I can see that road from here nearby the highway it's boring here is more peaceful more green both sides Hello Alvaro Such a beautiful house and garden here That's why I stopped Here you can see Now we are not far away from the Arden Centrum
let's receive the northern plate northern sign stadium bond stadium bond wins um, brotherhood like brotherhood <laughs> okay left side goes to northern boss would you like to see i think yes let's go <laughs> I have been there before, I have also a pre-recorded video from Northern Boss, it's not a big one. Uh, let's see. I hope connection will not go off. And I hope I will remember the entrance. Okay, where is the entrance? <laughs> Another boss, yes, I saw the entrance sign, but it's for car, yeah, the bike lane is over there. Let's go one kilometer left to Northern Centrum by following this Northern boss. Okay, we lost again, we got lost, <laughs> but I know a little bit this area. Yeah, we couldn't find another boss or it was like that, small part. But we know where Northern Centrum is, it's a good news and we found the yacht port. Awesome view here. Just in the right time we are here. The most beautiful lights, sunshine is over this small lake. Hello Kopai. Have a great evening, you too. It's a pity there is not a proper exit.
Uh, there should be a way to go to the left so we can get into the boss. Let me check if there is an entrance from here. Oh, the connection is not good here. Okay, go back. small island only one entrance <laughs> Hello Cyprus, greetings, it turned out we got in, a, in an island, only one entrance, no exit, we are just going back a little bit. This way, maybe. I'll drink soon. I have water with me. Hello, Cyprus, Christos.
Okay, I have checked the map finally and saw that we are getting away from Northern Centrum. So let's go back there. Good evening, UK. <laughs> nice one, Harjot. We stuck in this area. Let me check one more time for the final destination. Okay. So unfortunately we will be following the same way we came here. Let's go then. I'll try to be quick. Right, we found a way, finally. Uh, Harjot, Narden is more expensive than the other towns around this area. I'm not sure about the prices, but not less than 400,000 euro or 500,000 euro probably, at least minimum amounts. But you can check it from funda.nl, funda, F-U-F-U-N-D-A.nl. It's the biggest real estate website in the Netherlands and you can search by Northern name and you can see all the details. We lost some time in that area, but maybe that's better because the sunlight colors are more beautiful at this time. So when we arrive to Northern Centrum, I think we will see a better view. All right, we passed the highway. We are almost there then. Here. Okay. The next one. You're welcome. 
everyone in the Netherlands check Funda dot NL for real estate related things. Now I can see church tower in Arden in the distance. Maybe you cannot see that yet. And soon we will be there. Let's go to the other side. Oops, red one. I didn't notice. Sorry. What a cute bridge. Let's take a look to the wheel. Our famous bridge wheels, you know. <laughs> All right. Let's move on. This could be the thinnest bike lane 
in Holland only for one bicycle private bike lane Yes, Ellis, I know. <laughs> mm -hmm. I never do that in Amsterdam. But here it's kind of deserted. No one is here. Oops. So, as you see, it's been a long time I'm not coming here. I couldn't remember the way. Okay, entrances, yes. Here we can go. Alright, we are on the correct way. Let's go. Another peaceful area. I think the garden is a good place to live however you need a car generally it's not close to transportation stations I think I saw a bridge finally, let's see that. We are getting closer folks. As usual, we lost our way. But we are still good. Yeah. 
Yes, finally. I share short videos and pictures on daily basis on Instagram and TikTok. If you wish, you may follow my accounts. Instagram, follow my travels. YouTube, TikTok, follow my travels. Anna. Yes, we could see Northern Fortress. As I mentioned before, it's a fortified city since the Middle Age. And you may see the walls over there and the great church. So officially we arrived to an Arden city town. Let me get some drink water. This is my water bottle. Now I will go into the streets and I will show you northern streets.
We are in Narden, Kopai, Narden town city. This is our last station. I'm gonna show you around about 10, 10 15 minutes more. This is a good old style stone throat. It looks awesome, but not for riding. You're welcome, Alvaro and Copai, hello Rian, thanks everyone, let's go to the other street, the main street, as usual I see a crew in front of ice cream shop. Oh, I just remembered there is a beautiful bridge and entrance over there and a beautiful car appeared. from the distance so I can show you the entrance we just entered to the middle age back Look at the wheel. Those stone walls are part of uh, northern defense system. It surrounds the city, these uh, walls. So that's the star shape when you check on the Google Maps.
Ну. Sorry. The view on the left is impressive. Pads. Oh, it's a bike path. Let's see. Sorry, thank you. Sorry. Thank you. Please don't sleep. <laughs> this bike tour is going to be a 
like a meditation video or something pure nature slipping sounds hit the like button before sleep <laughs> Thanks for the feedback. I'm happy that you love this scene and atmosphere video. Actually, we turned around the star shape of the city. I think we will get into the city from the same point. We are almost there. So the city is there, and those are protective walls with star shape all around the city we just turn around and the other side is like this northern boss is over there i saw the sign again let's go on This is the road I know. I always use this bike lane when I arrive to Narden. You know what? It's possible to go up all the hills. Last year when everything was restricted, the only freedom was going out. 
I came here and there were many people around these hills. Everyone went on picnic. Uh, let's see which one. Let's go this way. I will park my bike on the upside to show you around. Let's spend some more calories. <laughs> Fatih Saraj, go back please. We will be riding our bikes uh, similar places in the future, I promise. Let's see, where was the park? I guess there is no bike park here but I will put my bicycle somewhere it's no problem We are riding through the highest place of the Netherlands. All right, now I'm gonna park my bike here since there is no bike lock place. I'm gonna put it here. We are not going to stay too much, just we will look at the wheel and come back, but first water, please. Let's go. Yes, I locked my bike. Actually, it doesn't need here. No one is around. And Snarden is a safe place, in my opinion. But still, I put my two locks, one for back wheel one for the middle area and they are strong yes now I'm gonna show you at the Narden I have to put this one to my back here's the Narden Great Church Tower I think it's a great church the Grote Kerk and uh, yeah this shape it goes like this all over the city also other side there are the same walls and this is the view normally it's more clean than this they regularly clean these uh, grasses and everyone sits around and also other hill it's possible to go there also you can follow this line for a while the shape and this was as I know it's here since 15th century should be a UNESCO heritage heritage
what will burn more calories when riding a bike or dancing the salsa at least i think the salsa because i used I used to I used I get got used to biking. I mean I more than 15 years regularly I ride my bike so my body not easily affected by riding my bicycle. I should ride hours and hours to burn some necessary calories. <laughs> It's a good looking, beautiful castle. However, probably they needed too many men to protect this city. It's a long sized uh, castle wall for a city who has just a few thousands residents. Okay, we finish here, dear fellow watchers, friends, numbers, thanks for watching. I will stay in Narden for a while and then I will go back to Wasp by following the same route. It's already 8.30, we did two hours again. I always start with one and a half hour something and I cannot finish before completing two hours. It's very high actually you now here. And I saw a balloon. It feels like Cappadocia. <laughs> it's not uh, often to see a balloon on the sky in the Netherlands. What a surprise, it's for me, I think. <laughs> Thanks everyone, see you on the next one. The next one will be on Saturday, also Sunday. And if you haven't done that already, please hit the like button. And follow my social media accounts. Instagram, follow my travels YouTube, TikTok, follow my travels NL. And join our Discord server if you would like to chat with other members. Uh, apart from the live streams, depends on you. The balloon is coming here to take my bike and me. <laughs> we will travel to waste with balloon, that will be interesting. You're welcome, everyone. See you the next time. Sundari, I will look back to whole video. Thanks, but you are not here, right? <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. We will do these nature tours maybe once a month, I think. I like this so much. In the evening, in the winter, and in cold weather, it's not uh, beautiful like this so in summer we will do this kind of tours as much as possible hopefully good evening and good day